Hello, I'm Danilo. And I'm Victor. In today's Money Hack, we're looking at ways to save money by backing up computer data like documents and photos to the cloud. There's money to be saved with the cloud. Seems like everyone is talking about the cloud, but it's sometimes hard to know where to start. First, what is the cloud? Well, the cloud is a network of servers that stores your data remotely. Okay, got it. But it seems people are often uncertain about putting their data on the cloud. Why is that? That's partly because cloud storage has undergone rapid changes over the past few years. And will likely continue to change? Of course. It's important to pay attention to updates to cloud service policies. So how can the cloud save people money? Well, for starters, it could help you avoid losing valuable data. All hard drives eventually fail. Many people have ended up taking their failed drives to data recovery service to retrieve data that just wasn't backed up. Never fun. So how much does that kind of data recovery cost? It can range between $400 to $2,000. In most cases, it's around $1,500. But can't you just back up to an external drive? Yes, but beware. First, a lot of people fail to back up regularly. That means when their external drive fails, they lose most of their recent data. Also, too many people save to an external drive and then delete that data from their personal computer. That means it's only on one drive, which is a big no-no. What about privacy with the cloud? Some people don't want to put their personal data on cloud services. Cloud service safeguards are considered very secure, but it's still not something some people are comfortable with, and that's okay. But for most people, the encryption used by cloud service companies is enough to give them confidence. Good to hear. Are there any other people out there who just aren't a good fit for the cloud? If you live in an area with really slow internet, then storing large amounts of data in the cloud is a bad idea because uploads and downloads will be slow. You don't want to waste your life staring at a progress bar. Exactly. But do cloud services cost money? Some do, especially if you have a lot of data to store. But you can now get a decent amount of storage space for free. Can you give us some examples? Sure. Google Drive, Dropbox, and iCloud are some of the big ones. Google Drive gives you 15 gigabytes, iCloud gives you 5 gigabytes, and Dropbox gives you 2. All for free. That's enough space to at least back up some of your most important and frequently used documents and photos. And that would sync automatically with my computer. Yes. Once you set it up, as you modify your documents, so will the backups in the cloud. That's slick. Yes, and it saves money. It could save a priceless photo or a $1,500 trip to the closest data recovery facility. That's serious though, serious. Thanks for sharing, Victor, and thank you all for joining us on today's Money Hack.